What's going on ladies and gentlemen? It's Dan here. I have something new to the channel for you guys. It's another subscription box. Now, okay, I'm gonna stop right there. I know what you guys are thinking. Oh my God, Dan, another subscription box. You do enough of these on the channel. We're done with them. But honestly, let me explain. I honestly think you guys are gonna like this one. This one is different from the rest. And I'm gonna explain why. Essentially what they do, it's obviously monthly subscription. However, what they end up doing is take indie games okay take some of your favorite indie games and collector's edition them that's correct normally what happens with an indie game well because of in the way indie games are they can't get distributed other than digitally you know a lot of these guys are smaller developers they don't have that kind of money to publish something on a wide spectrum in physical copies or for do a collector's edition for that matter so what this company does is take some of your favorite indie games turn them into collector's editions and release them physically as well. So you have something to show and you know, you could, it's obviously it comes with the game as well. And it's a different one every single month. That's why I figured you guys would like this particular uh, subscription box because it's a little more unique. It's like unboxing a collector's edition every single month with something you would not see. So if you go with these guys, you're going to have something that's insanely unique from the average person. You know, you're not going to be like you'll be able to showcase something and be like, where'd you get that? You can't get that in stores. No, you have to get it through here. So I think that's such a cool idea, which is why I agreed to do this. And I think you guys are going to like it. So hopefully you do. Let's check it out. Indie box. Bam. Let's get started. Okay, guys. So now this is laid out a little bit differently than usual, but I'm going to do my best to show it. Right on the top of the box, we have our, it gives you what we're unboxing today. Indie box, this is from March, and the reason they gave me March was because they wanted to give me an April box, but they didn't have any at the time. They had completely run out, so they're like, don't worry, we have some Marches, at least you could show something new on your channel. And then for the next following months, we'll pick things up from where we should be. So anyway, the first game we are unboxing right now is Typo Man. Typo Man Revised. Now, I'm not too familiar with this Indie game, but it shows you everything that comes with it in this little pamphlet. But we know what we're dealing with here, so I'm going to put that there. Now, this thing... Honestly, the, the box, it's not one of those things where you just grab something out of the box. It's a legit collector's edition, ladies and gentlemen. Like, okay, I'm gonna, like, look, we're done with the box. It's empty. So let's put it off to the side. And we have Typo Man Revised in a lovely, like, this is a collector's edition. This is something you would see. And, wow. Really? Holy. Wait a minute. So this is, okay. I'm sorry. I'm gonna, I'm gonna chill out for a minute. Just to give you guys an idea, this is a limited edition, okay? This, on the back... I have 2,134 of 3,000. So obviously it's not the most rare one, but considering there's only 3,000 of these in the world and I have one of them, that is cool. I love rare things like this. And not only that, that explains why he couldn't give me a April crate or an April box rather, because they were out. They only make a certain amount. So they happen to have an extra one. So I think that's awesome. But also on the side, we have a little number that says, that says three of 12 for 2017. I'm not sure what that means. Um, but maybe, maybe, I don't know, maybe they worked with Typo Man, like the devs of Typo Man, but it's distributed by IndieBox. So that could be it. So IndieBox maybe only got a few of these. I'm not hundred percent sure, but I'm curious to find out what's in this box, what we get. And I can't wait to share, share this with you. I think this is such a good idea. Here's it without the wrap on. What a smart way to do it. So you get a cool indie game, physical copy with some cool extras as well. So I'm going to give you guys a full look. Uh, obviously the front, here's the side, and obviously you can see the numbers there, 3 of 12, and on the back as well. So we got, obviously, Type of Man. So Brain Seed is the development studio for this guy. Now, if we open up the top, let's see what we have in here. Ooh, I'm liking what I'm seeing already. So the first thing we got is our little Typo Man kind of a set here. I think this is a pen holder, because, hold on, I'll, I'll take all these things out. I'll put this off to the side for, for a second, just so we can kind of get an idea of what we're dealing with here. And we got to kind of assemble this, and I think he's a pen holder. So, just like this. This is actually a really nice pen. This is something that I would very much like to go on my, on my desk. So, hold on. I'm going to get this built, and then I'll show you guys properly. Okay, so actually, that's all it is to it. That's all you have to do is set them up like so. Throw your pen in there. Call it a day. So you can have quick access. You can throw it on your desk or whatever you're doing. I think that is really neat. So I'm going to throw them off to the side. That's our, that's our like little figure. Now these things aren't going to be massive. You're not going to have massive like figures like we normally unboxing our collector's editions. But it's something that you can't get anywhere else. So that leaves the game itself 
Look at this, guys. It looks like like a, a, a console game cover, but it's got the Indie Box logo right on the top. Like, this is just insanely neat. Like, I, I just such a good idea. So, Typo Man Revised by Brain Seed. PC version, if I'm not mistaken. Usually, that's what they dev for. Um, in the On the inside here, we have an instruction manual with two physical copies of the game. Obviously, or sorry, I, I could be wrong. Sorry. Uh, one is a soundtrack. My bad. One's a soundtrack. One is the actual game for Typo Man. Installation disc. So, I'm sure it, it probably is a disc that installs and then you can utilize it in Steam and everything. That's going to be my guess there. So, I'm going to go ahead and take the book out. I think there's more than just this. There's actually an indie box with... A Typo Man style sticker here. So essentially what it is is indie box sticker, but you can probably collect all these stickers and eventually they'll have, you know, very based on the theme of the game that you're unboxing, they'll all be kind of suited to that. We'll see when we get the next one. The little sticker sticker here that we can use. I'm gonna grab the uh, instruction book, just kind of take a peek of it. It's a handbook to help you with the game and all that kind of stuff, how it works. Uh, it kind of reminds me, this game, I've never played it, the way this thing looks, it kind of reminds me of Limbo. Kind of the same kind of shadowy thing, but I'm sure it's a bit different. But it's a, it's a cool looking thing. Like, good God, guys. There's an instruction book there. I keep knocking over the sticker. Damn it, don't knock my sticker over. It's my sticker, man. Obviously, I'm going to take this thing off and see what else we have. Installation disc. And then Typo Man soundtrack. This one's a little different. You have to, like, slide it from the bottom. And then pull up. But it's got like an... Oh, I want to show that to you if I can. Here's... I've never seen a case like this, but... If you could see that, it's got like a little slide section. That you just kind of put the... The the the, uh, the soundtrack in. Kind of slide it down. It's like a cradle. See, it's holding it in right now, but it's not pressed down yet. And then you just kind of push it in. That's a good idea. That way it keeps it secure. You don't have to worry about it. Because I don't know if you guys have ever had a dual installation disc. Do you remember back in like... I want to say 2012 and prior like 2010 to 2012 roughly uh games started getting way too big and the consoles at the time were the ps3 and the xbox 360 and you needed two discs to play it eventually you you had to install one and then you had to uh you know switch discs on the fly when you got to a certain part of the game i remember doing that and every single game came with two discs and it was just like that but sometimes you'd open it and the top one would have slid out because this thing wasn't held properly and it would just it would just kind of make a, you know, a possibility of you damaging your game. So uh, it's good to see that they have something neat like this. Little bonuses. But that is just a pleasant thing to look at. Like, I'm going to give you guys a proper look of Type of Man here. There you go. Like, it's, it's a very nice little thing to like just kind of take a peek at. I think it's really, really cool. I think this is a genius idea. And I am just so happy that I got a chance to try this out. And I want to thank these guys for uh, contacting me and getting me in the loop. So I'm going to go through the book now. Now that we have the collector's edition unboxed, that's everything. I'm going to actually seal this up for better presentation purposes. There we go. And I'm going to go ahead and go through the items so we can read them off and give you guys an idea of what the game is, what's it about, etc. All right. So what's in March 2017 Indie Box? Typo Man Revised Collector's Edition Box. Beautiful. Bend words to your will and alter the environment in Typo Man Revised, an award-winning adventure full of ingenious and challenging puzzles. This collector's edition box showcases the darkly surreal and beautifully atmospheric landscape you will traverse as you change words to change the world. Interesting, hence the Typo Man, which is why the pen is there. That makes way more sense. Opening things up with the Typo Man fountain pen. A hero's journey is tough and full of dangers, but you don't have to face them alone. The Typo Man revised fountain pen is on hand to help you take on the dark creatures of oppression and tyranny, also known as your daily tasks. Let the ink flow. That's cool. And also on the other side here, we have the Typo Man revised standard edition case. Um, the Typo Man revised standard edition case contains a DRM free installation disc. So it's not region locked, essentially. Official soundtrack disc, full color instruction manual, and a Typo Man revised themed indie box sticker. To spell evil with the power of words, or just entertain yourself by seeing what you can spell. The choice is yours. Oh wait, so can I? No, okay, I thought it was maybe something else. Maybe I'll put this in front, that way you can actually see what it says. Alright, let's see what else we got here. And finally, the main meat and meat of this un unboxing here is the hero figure. I'd say, well, it's, that's debatable, I guess. Debatable. Um, Words are hero's weapons as he fights for truth and freedom. Now hero can help you wage intellectual war by standing tall on your desk. There's even a place to display your mightiest weapon, 
the Typo Man Revised Fountain Pen, which we've already got sporting right then and there. So that's really cool. I actually want to check something real quick. I didn't actually open this. Oh my god. I've never... This is... This isn't just a ball tip pen, guys. Regular point and... It's, it is... This is, this is a, like an old school fountain pen. Like it actually is. Like, hold on. I'm going to give you guys a close look. Look. Like here, hold on. I'll show this thing. With the point. That is absolutely insane. It looks like an old school pen. I wonder if it, I don't want to draw. I don't like writing on myself, but. At any rate, ladies and gentlemen, that is what we got in this collector's edition. And I am, I don't know what it is. I think, I just love collector's editions. I really, really do. I think they're such an interesting way to kind of look at a game and see for, like it gives you the opportunity to see it as a work of art rather than just something to enjoy and just sit down and play you know but that's why i like getting collector's editions when i can uh but this is a genius idea i think it's just one of the smartest ones because i love being I'm, I'm a collector i have been for a long time and it's just a nice refreshing change to uh you know the other subscription boxes out there that I'm sure a lot of people might be a bit sick of and I understand that but this is different this is I don't really look at this as, as a, a subscription box I look at this as a collector's edition unboxing so I think it's just so cool that I you know they contacted me and they want me to showcase it for you guys and I am so happy that I'm able to do that like look at this truly amazing I think this is something that you can actually do because you actually get a game out of it guys you get a game and a limited edition version of said game one that bare, not many people have that you can say, yo dog, I got that. I think that's just so cool. The, the whole limited aspect of it is really neat. And the fact that guys like, I ran out, I don't have any more April because they all sold out. This gives you an idea. You can't, you gotta do it fast. You know, if you want something, you gotta order it so you can get in on the, on the action. So I am so excited. I can't wait to see the next one. I know this was March's. So because this was March's, we might end up getting another one this month, but I don't know right now. I don't want to speak ahead of me, uh, but I would definitely like to keep this going. I think it's something that I think you guys would really like. I think it's something that you guys will tune in to see. And depending on what game it is, and if I have time, maybe I'll do a let's play of said game that I unbox. Obviously, I won't be able to do every single one, depending on the time frame and everything. But if it's if that's the case, maybe I will pick some pick up these collector's edition ones, or sorry, the the game itself, and get, do a let's play on it. I think that'd be kind of neat. So. You guys are definitely going to have to let me know what you thought of this in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, you like what you see, this is something you'd like to see me continue on a monthly basis, be sure to slap that like button, helps out a lot. If you haven't yet, be sure to like and follow my pages on social media in the description at the end card of this video. I recommend you guys do that because then you see advanced looks at this kind of stuff. You also get the chance to chat with me. A lot of people can I always say this. People can never believe it when I respond to them on Snapchat or Twitter or Facebook or whatever. And they're like, I can't believe it. I'm like, I tell you guys to follow me. That's why I tell you to follow me. I can actually speak with you guys there. It's what I like to do. And you guys get to see some daily, you know, my daily life, daily adventures, things like that. So go do that. Uh, Twitter, DanQ8000. Uh, Facebook, DanQ8000. Instagram, DanQ8K. Snapchat, DanQ8000. Go add me, follow me on there. It's a great time. Trust me. It's, you see a lot of things outside of YouTube. It's way more personal. So I recommend you guys go check that out. And I guess if you want to get yourself a shirt or hoodie of mine, there's a link to my spreadsheet shop in the description as well. And if you want to check out IndieBox, link right in the description. Check it out. I think it's awesome. I, I can't wait to get my next one. So thank you guys so much for watching. Take it easy. Have a wonderful day. I'll be seeing you soon for more content. But till then, let's hand things over to Knox Hill. Have a good one, guys. Who's the man with the plan? Hmm. If you feel trouble, wild and wild, don't need violent and hit you. 8,000. Wait a minute. Hold that style. It's style. Damn. Goddamn, Billy Jack. We still riding. Tires flat. I hear them sirens. Sea shots flying. So we driving. Fire back. If they ain't vibing, lie with that. Got me dressed up in all black. What up? Hood up. And I see them haters. Try to run with us. They don't need inhalers. Gotta breathe them hard. Just like the beta players. Grab your respirators. Night invaders get light. Savored. Mass on for the shooters. Move like Trash the bed intruder, got that glocking, got them woofers, just press play, I'll keep it moving, who is Knox, still you damn fools, keep it fresh like canned food, there ain't nothing we can't do, so tune into that damn Q. Yeah, it was never, ever a game.